Hey guys, Commander Tech One here, and today I'll be doing an app review of Tweetbot for the iPhone. This app came out recently and has been getting a lot of buzz for the good looking app it is with the creative design behind it. So you can get this app for about a buck ninety nine in the App Store. So we'll just hop right in here. So here you got accounts. So you can add uh, accounts if you wanted to. Edit, add, whatever, rearrange them. Uh, click this button. Here's your profile. So as you can see already, the colors of the app just look good. The uh, black with a slightest gray tinge everywhere with the blue, it just pops out. So here you got also settings. Uh, you got the options to change the sounds, uh, post and background, account settings, support, about, uh, other options here. Okay, let's uh, jump into my account. Here's my timeline. So as you can hear, I just got some more tweets. Here's 12 tweets. And those are my tweets to reload just like that pretty simple so we'll jump into my replies so what's cool here is if you slide to the left you see the conversation between uh, so in this for instance it's between me and Angry Birds uh, this will work for anything so you see the conversation between uh, you and the other person mentioning or replying. This is a cool feature. Um, then you also have the option of sliding to the right. So when you do that, it shows you related tweets. So here I found a related tweet by Alan, whatever. That's pretty cool. I don't know how much I'll be using it but it is a cool option and you do have it that would be cool if you want to search for a topic that they mentioned or something so here is messages then you got your favorites and then over here is your search you can search Twitter find people have your saved searches uh, get rid of them your trending down here as you can hear there's sounds for every click every refresh overall they just made this app really fun to use and good to look at so kudos for tweetbot uh, let's just pretend like we're making a new tweet here where they do need to improve is the landscape keyboard they just don't have the landscape keyboard this is something I need in a Twitter client to uh, tweet fastly, if that's even a word. But I need a landscape uh, keyboard. I haven't used Tweetbot. I'm still using the official uh, Twitter client, which works fine. But I need a landscape keyboard. So I talked to Tweetbot. They said that they're working on it and that they'll push it to the next update. So that's good. I'll hopefully be able to have a nice switch to Tweetbot from the official Twitter app. But if not, that's okay. The uh, official Twitter app does work great. So we'll start writing a tweet. Um, I am I am writing a tweet. And then if I wanted to mention let's say tweetbot so then what you have to do is you click this little person and then you can search so tweetbot and then you tap I personally would have them have that more integrated in the actual tweet where in like most Twitter clients do you just uh, start uh, typing the Twitter contact or profile whatever 
and then it'll show you the list of the people that have that but Tweetbot doesn't I hope they do have that so I talked to them about this issue and the keyboard they said they're working on it and that they'll probably have the next update out uh, as soon as possible and they'll fix some of these minor issues but kudos to Tweetbot for making a good app that works and just looks beautiful and it's fun to use so kudos to them and this was an app review of Tweetbot for the iPhone and I am Commander Tech One and I am signing out uh, if you like my video please comment at saying uh, your comments about this app um, also rate my video and if you want to see more videos like this, please uh, subscribe to my channel and you'll be updated on my new videos. So once again, Commander Tech 1 signing out.